Uh, today's session, we will talk about uh, the HR tech, human resources tech, about moving HR operations to the cloud. So without further ado, let's welcome Mr. Anthony. I, I spent 10 years uh, in China before starting Kaketangan. So uh, back then, uh, five years of which uh, I was in the Microsoft. Uh, we we grow the office uh, the team actually. So well, we, I was involved in our office 2013 um, and then the uh, office uh, the, on the 365 we call it today uh that, that time when we that, that was the first time we actually bring it to the cloud and then android office and so on so after that i i i moved to another company uh, a smaller size networking company uh also listed in nasdaq uh, so that was the time that actually i managed a uh, uh, different size of the team uh, from 30 to 100 people the goal and the concept uh, it, it's it's how do you actually design uh, the, the, the higher purpose for the very beginning, right? What am I doing? Am I influencing uh, the society for the good? Am I helping the country? Am I R&D on a new thing? What is the thing that people are working out? And how do they gel and happy to be here? So if you look at it, uh, that, that's a joke that nowadays when we talk about people and HR uh, part of things, um, is getting in more and more into a marketing skill set. The, the reality is uh, when we ask around, uh, anyone, we think that we actually do enough of this. And most of the case, we say not enough. And then why? And then it comes back to the payroll, la, the, uh, the, the, this paper for work, that paperwork issue, la, right? This, this is a fun part. Do you agree if this is the two most important work? If you agree this is the most important work, then most of your time should actually focus on it. The rest try to automate. This is exactly what, uh, we have taken, uh, you know, uh, uh from, uh, customer sites. Like, uh, this is actually how tough is the paperwork, right? On, on their on their on their this is uh, Li Fong, right? Which is crazy, right? Uh from Jess. Uh Leaf record. Wait, I broadcast this one. I see. Uh, yeah. Okay. So so the question it's uh can we actually do uh, according to a contract period? Yeah, at the moment uh I, I cannot do that yet. So it's always in the uh development pipeline. So what we do it's uh we are yearly uh we we actually can set the beginning of the year in a different month so some for example some fmb they always want to refresh the leave entitlement not at the beginning of the year the, they they normally do say middle of the year so that uh, they uh, so that a lot of, not a lot of people will actually go into a leave leave uh, the vacancy by you know uh, the end of the year or beginning of the year Thank mm -hmm. you.